Many hundreds of millions of people depend on aquatic foods for their livelihoods, with small-scale fisheries making a significant contribution. We know and we understand how is the important the resource for them. The, it's, it's everything for them. They look like it's life for them. Why are blue foods so beneficial? Food from the ocean generally has far greater nutritional benefits than animal foods produced on land. Small pelagic fish, such as anchovies and sardines, are one of the most nutritious sources of protein. We do know that aquatic foods, because of its nutritional value, is important for a growing population. Not just the quantity of food that we produce and supply, but also the nutritional value and food safety. Blue foods cause less harm to the environment than most land-based animal foods. Wild-caught seafood also has a lower carbon footprint than red meat, cheese or chicken. I think the world is at a crossroads. We're heading to a population of 10 billion people and those 10 billion people need to be fed. It's therefore imperative that we generate more food but from sustainable food production systems. And this is the deep attraction of uh, the United Nations blue transformation. How can we get more aquatic food to give people the low carbon nutritious food that they actually need to help the planet live within ecological limits? But to ensure that our growing population can benefit from blue foods, we have to make changes fast. Much of the growth needed in blue food production will come from aquaculture, but wild capture fisheries will play an essential role too. And aquatic foods can be part of the solution for a number of reasons. First, the enormous diversity. We have more than 3,000 species that we capture or that we culture in the world, compared to a very few that we grow on land. Second, they are more efficient and more effective in translating feed to flesh. And the third is because in terms of greenhouse gas uh, production, they are much more effective and efficient than land-based animals. We can't live without a healthy, thriving ocean. The more we take care of the ocean, the more we maintain the richness of our marine life and secure seafood supplies for future generations.